guys so today we're working on a commercial property um this is for um, a commercial client and they just need it cleaned up and looking back nice um we're going to get this on our um i think i'm going to put it on a bi-weekly in the winter time because it's winter now and it doesn't need a weekly just right now so i think we're going to put this on a bi-weekly and just keep it cleaned up tons of leaves around um it's way more leaves than what it actually looks like. I know it doesn't look like a lot here, but it was tons and tons of leaves. Um, so we're going to get it cleaned up and uh, looking good for them. Um, yeah, when we do commercials, we like to really do them nice and stuff because it's somebody business. It always has traffic there 24-7. Uh, so first thing we did, we started off by um, trimming our hedges up. Trimming them, man. I like, again, as you saw in my previous video, I like to use the big hedges first to just kind of get the rough coarse areas off and shape it up. And then when I'm done shaping it, I'll come back with my smaller hedges and really like tighten it up and clean it up. Oh um, man, when you're doing these properties, like do them right. Take your time and do them right. Like I'm, I blew all the leaves you can't see it but behind those bushes it was just years and years of leaves and old leaves that whoever was landscaping just left back there and i took my time in this job and blew them all out from behind this um from behind these bushes so we could get pine straw or mulch or something laid in there and really get this property together for the property owner and those are all little things that matter that obviously the last company or most companies won't do but I think at this point I had already blown out all the leaves from the back. You can see me blowing some out back actually right there. Those are coming from behind the bushes. There was tons of them, maybe two feet of leaves stacked behind these bushes. So Blowing them all out, blowing them all out. Because, again, I want to come in and put pine straw or mulch in there and really get this property looking good. This is my first time um, taking care of this property, and we want to do a good job with it for our clients. This is us mowing. So what I did, I blew all the leaves that were in the primary yard into the middle of this field so we could mulch them up and mow them. Not all of them. I blew some of them in the back of the woods. But most of them I blew out in this primary area of the business and mulched them up. Mulched them up in this field really good. And we have mulching blades plus shoot blockers on our mowers. So we can mulch them up really good and fine. And Again, you can't tell, but this is a, maybe two feet of leaves. A huge pile of two feet of leaves that... We take care of, and we blew a lot of them into the woods. So beautiful day to be out mowing and just enjoying the scenery and cars ride by. Like you get to mow commercial work, man. It's just it's a beautiful job, and I, we love what we do here. Blowing all of these curbs out. These curbs maybe were a foot high with leaves all around the entire curbs of the property. That's one thing that the business owner stressed me, that he was tired of looking at all the leaves. So my main priority was getting those leaves straight and getting those hedges together. <clears throat> this is our first mow on this property again. So you give us two or three mows, we're going to have this thing looking right. And you got to remember it's winter time too, so no grass really looks good in the winter. But in springtime, we're going to have this thing in shape. And uh, we blew out all this parking lot was full of leaves. These curves were full of leaves. These hedges were overgrown, full of leaves behind here. Guys, I can't stress to you enough how many leaves it was on this job that we had to get off. Um, but we got it back looking good. We're going to get some pine straw down here, I'm thinking. That'll do best. I would say mulch, but those roots from the plants are going into the yard, and we can't put a border around that mulch, so I've... I would personally like pine straw around here better. I prefer mulch, but pine straw would be more ideal for this job. Just walking the property, making sure everything look good. There's no trash around. There's no debris. We got them back looking nice. Thanks.